I have made a severe and continuous lapse in my judgment. I don't expect to be forgiven. But I left the keep inventory <laughs> true cheat on by accident. I'm sorry, okay? It wasn't some elaborate plan to keep my inventory when I died. I, I You overestimate me. Do you really think I'm that smart? I'm stupid, I tell you, I'm stupid. <laughs> my, whole, my whole setup is shaking. But that's how upset I am and how apologetic I am. But now that that's out of the way, I can stop pretending to be Logan Paul. Not that I want to. Oh god, I've got so much stuff. How am I supposed to fit all this in my inventory and bring it all home? Well, I guess I could wear this. It's like going down the street completely naked with your clothes under your arm going like, God, why are these so heavy? Okay, my inventory's full. I'm getting out of here. God damn it. This is gonna be hard to get home, isn't it? I, I just remember that I got so frustrated trying to find this place that I didn't make a direct path, but I, it's not too far, I think, to get home. Oh, for feck's sake, give me a break. I've defeated the Ender Dragon. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was about to start threatening him, but uh, it wasn't even needed. I actually killed him in one shot. I think it was here, wasn't it? Yes, I found it. Great. Okay, this is going great. I just want to get home. I'm sick of the end and I'm sick of the nether. Plus, all my prisoners, I, I, my friends are missing me back home, I bet. I think I can actually make an iron golem now because I found the those pumpkins. That's the greatest outcome from from this whole end scenario. Wait. Did I? How that? I came up here. How did I manage to turn around in a completely straight tunnel? Did I turn around? <laughs> Am I real? <laughs> Am I really Logan Paul? <laughs> okay, I somehow managed to feck up. I turned around to throw down this bit of fence and I somehow managed to turn around, <laughs> drop the fence and then do a 360 and go back the way I came somehow. I don't even know how I managed that. The important thing is I'm getting out of here. I don't even like where this is. It drops me off in danger and every time I come back it seems to be night. God, this is going to be a complete episode of me complaining, isn't it? <laughs> Alright. How about some of the positive for a change? Um, I have lovely prisoners waiting for me at home. That's nice. Out of my land. Get off. I don't appreciate people being different to me. Get out of here. <laughs> That's a great thing to say on the internet. <sighs> I've made a severe and continuous lapse in my judgment. Hey guys, you wouldn't believe the rough day I had. <laughs> For some reason, I don't think they're gonna have much sympathy. Hey, wake up, I wanna trade with you. No, not bed spawn set, no! Oh god damn it, now I'm gonna have to go sleep. There are monsters. Feck off, I'm a monster myself. By that logic, there'll always be a monster near. You know, this whole place needs more defense. We need that iron golem, and we need to build a perimeter around us so that we're safe. Oh my god, look at this, there's an invasion! Little do they know what I'm protecting them from. Even though one of my prisoners already died, actually two of my prisoners died. We don't have the greatest, like, success rate when it comes to prisoners staying alive. He wants cola? Why, why, what does this bell do? I want to know why it's worth 36 emeralds. I'm going to humor you here. It sends them to bed. Actually, that seems quite fitting for a prison. I kind of like the idea of that. Um, can you guys, like, make babies? I need more prisoners. Oh, he's doing the old sticks for emeralds trade again. Wait, did you derank? Oh, you did because the proper Fletcher died. I forgot. Oh, god damn it. All right, let's start this off by cleaning my inventory and then replacing these doors immediately. In fact, give me the doors now. I'm getting so sick of these feckin' doors and they're only getting people killed. They're not good. There we go. And it's kind of better because it actually leaves in less light. The iron ones have a little window on them, which I did not appreciate. All right, I realize this could be perceived as something kind, but I like to think of it as letting them see what they can't have, you know? So in a way, it is still being a dick. Just any way that I can help myself sleep at night, you know? I think I have enough iron to make one of those golem thingies. I wish I could smelt down these doors. There's so many of them and I do not want. Wait, I had a pumpkin in here the entire time. Feck's sake. <laughs> Why did I keep it in here? I'm about to try something incredibly risky and that's just attempting to fix my sword without even using a wiki or anything. <laughs> okay, in this goes. Wait, can we rename it? Feck Slayer. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh yeah, okay, that worked. Awesome. This is great news. So I need four Four blocks and I how do I make a block it's it's not that is it no it's not that okay it must be everything is it oh god can I yes I can just about afford that nice oh wait that that needs to be a jack-o-lantern how do I do that no don't make it into pumpkin seed oh god damn it <laughs> what do I do <laughs> okay it's pretty self-explanatory you just put a torch under it Okay, that, that didn't work at all. <laughs> is the wiki wrong for once? Because if so, I'll never figure it out by myself. Oh, okay, use the shears on it. Okay, that also makes perfect sense. I mean, I guess there's no point in just smashing a candle into it <laughs> if there's nothing actually caught into it. There you go. Wow, really nice artwork there. I might try and grow some pumpkins, actually. That would be nice. 
Ah, yes. The glorious sounds of imprisonment. So we put the head up there. I don't even know what's gonna happen once this does absolutely nothing. Oh, okay. I think I may need to have to actually place them. Okay, this is just a train wreck. <laughs> I can't figure out what I'm doing at all. I guess I need him more in the backyard, so I'm just gonna make a sacrifice over here. Oh, God, he's gonna walk straight into the cow pit, isn't he? All right, you ready for this? I'm willing to sacrifice all of you if this doesn't work. Does this please you, my lord? Does this please you? The villagers, like, I wish he didn't install that window. Hmm. Why am I not good at summoning anything? Like, I made a sacrifice. Villagers, come over here a second. <laughs> Is the grass in the way? Maybe he's just picky. He doesn't want it to be a mess when he comes alive. That's understandable. I'm sure I had some demands when I was born. Now, go. Wait. Go. Yes! Created! Wow, you have a hell of a nose, buddy. <laughs> you definitely adopted, because I don't think I have any nose. Well, welcome to the prison. You are now guard number one. <laughs> Actually, no, I want- uh, You're guard number two. I'm guard number one. I feel like this whole place needs some work, you know? It's just a feckin' disaster. Where is my shovel? Oh my god, I just saw fire and I thought it was the feckin' golem. I was like, no, I just created you. Why do you want to die? Like, I'd understand, but at least tell me. I'm leaving a light down here, because even though I'm closing you off, I don't want anyone living on my land. Even if it's under my land and not disturbing me at all. A lot of this land is just one thin layer of dirt. It's not the best land to be living on, building a prison on, or farming on. Or having, like, a metric ton of cows on. I'm basically child-proofing the farm, and I don't know if it's for me or the iron golem at this point. I think it might be more for me. Oh, Jesus Christ! Ow! Feck's sake, golem, you're supposed to protect me. <laughs> okay, this is unsightly, too. We gotta feckin' fix this. We gotta make it into, like, a little cave. Maybe we can dig a cave here. That's right. It's gonna be a building episode. <laughs> I need to fix this. This has been driving me absolutely nuts. I've just had it since I moved in and I just... It's one of those things you just kind of get used to and you just never do anything about it. There we go. It's still not fixed, but it's closer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm such a terrible person at everything. Oh, there's my phone. The universe does not want me to record today. Okay, we're back. All right. I swear there was a power cut as I started recording this and I had to start again. <laughs> and then the power came back on and I went off my laptop. I was sending emails with 4G and whatnot. I was like, oh great, I can go record now. And I shut down my laptop, turn on my PC and the power goes immediately. <laughs> I was like, right, someone up there doesn't want me to record. It's simple. God hates Minecraft. That is the answer. <laughs> I've long suspected it. I really wish I had mossy cobble and I threw so much of it away. All right, normal cobble. Well, it is like a feckin' peasant. Yeah, shut up, you're a prisoner, get over it. You'd think you'd be used to it by now. I kind of like that, that it joins in kind of jagged. And then, then we'll go straight down. Well, not straight down, because that would make everyone upset with me. But we're going to go down a little stairs and loop back into that tunnel, and then we can cover it up. You would think I could just plan this out and, you know, try and connect these tunnels, but I, I don't think I, I want to do that. I think I just want to take a random guess and try and connect them. Yes, no preparation wins again. <laughs> I don't think I even need to light this place. Who would want to spawn here with all those cows being annoying? There we go. Now that's looking pretty cool. That's pretty nifty. Now we sleep. <laughs> God, I'm not getting a lot done in each day, am I? <laughs> are these after hatching yet? No, you are lazy. Whoever's in that egg. Lazy bastards. In fact, you know what? If you're going to be that lazy, you don't deserve to live. Come on, stomp on them. Stomp on the eggs. Oh, he's not breaking. <laughs> God, those are some strong eggs. There we go. Oh, that's a satisfying noise. Oh, I love it. <laughs> He's just staring at me like, dude, what is wrong with you? <laughs> You've imprisoned me here to have babies, and when I do it, you just smash them. Well, you know what? You're ruining my view, <laughs> even though I put you here. <laughs> On the bright side, you are free to go. You can go wherever you want. Literally, since the dawn of time in this world, you have not moved, like, more than five feet. Oh, look at you. You're free to go, and you're happy about it. He had no doubts there. He wanted out. I need to do something about this too. <laughs> like, I'm not thrilled about what's going on here. I like that he's a prisoner, but I don't like that he's kind of hee-hawing away inside that little unsightly block. Oh my god, yeah, I forgot the whole place is built on one layer of dirt. Okay, let's fix this. You know, I want to make a little blacksmithing area, but I think I might use a different wood. I've got uh, something here. Yeah, dark uh, oak logs, and it'll be good. It brings back memories when I burnt down that tower. <laughs> it may have a problem, you know. That problem is I don't have enough dark oak. I should have burned down more towers. There, that looks kind of cool. 
cool, I, I think. I mean, it's a little blacksmith area. It, it does the job. Now, I can just build a little wall around this guy, but he seems to be able to jump fences, or at least he got out somehow last time. I was going to say this pen is kind of small, but I guess compared to the cows, he's living in a feckin' paradise. Let's just be clear. This isn't for you. This is for me. <laughs> Your little crib there was a bit unsightly, and it was annoying me, but appreciate it because it can go away like that. Oh my god, there's someone at the door. <laughs> the universe just doesn't want this to happen. The universe hates building episodes. <laughs> Do you hate building episodes? Please let me know <laughs> while I go get the door. <laughs> Take a few seconds to just write a comment, you know? One day we'll finish this video, don't worry. Just stick in there. <laughs> we'll do it together. There we go. And the gate even sticks out. That's really nice. I like how he turned around there. <laughs> it's like, oh, I didn't want to leave anyway. <laughs> I love how you can't hear any cows here. And then you step one bit forward, you can. No cows? Cows. I get pleasure out of the simplest things. <laughs> Imprisonment. Oh my god, this whole area is a mess too! Every time I look and in a new place, there's just so much to do. Hello? Oh my god, how big is this cave? Jesus. People could tunnel underneath me and, and grief me and stuff. I don't think zombies are smart enough though. Now, once the grass grows back there, we'll be doing pretty good, I think. And now we gotta clean up this mess. Jesus Christ. I wonder how many views this will get. <laughs> An Irish man digging up dirt. <laughs> oh, entertainment of the century. Century. This is somehow really relaxing. I don't know, all I'm doing is just digging dirt. That is all I'm doing, but there's just rain, like, well, Minecraft rain, which is kind of relaxing the same way normal rain is. And I'm just getting stuff done, like I'm improving my little view in my house. It's nice. I feel like this is Jim's retirement. Like, the horses are just looking at him when <laughs> I forgot I named my donkey horse. <laughs> you can be moved soon, don't worry. But he's kind of calmed down. He's gone under uh, big adventures. It's kind of like the prologue in like a Red Dead Redemption game. All he wants to do is farm. Look at that. Look how open it is now. This is looking fantastic. I love it. Got a lovely little view here now that the little the prison is gone. Look at them. They all come crawling back. They don't know what it's like to live on the outside anymore because I had them imprisoned for so long. I do all this work and Golem won't even come over. He t he's just hanging around the prison. He's loitering. Ah, look at all this wheat. Yes. <laughs> Cows have gone nuts. <laughs> they don't even have space to go nuts. They're stuck. Y you don't want bread? Come on. Take the bread. Uh. Yes. How much bread do you need to fall in love? I'd need like two slices at most. Uh. Oh, they closed the door. They must be getting at it. <laughs> I'll do your job since you're not feckin' harvesting this. What am I trying to build? A stairs out of feckin' wheat? What am what's wrong with me? Okay, you definitely have enough bread to do the deed. Come on. Oh, oh, I think they're... Oh, no. <laughs> That's just an awkward way of bumping into each other. Okay, the wiki says they need three bread, so I've been scammed, I think. Feckers, maybe they just don't like me watching. I don't understand why. <laughs> yeah, I think I'll just leave them to it. They just need time, I think, to learn to love each other. All right, the house is definitely looking better. It's got a lovely little view now. It's got a bit of an expansion. I think it could do with a bit more sand, but I'll have to go rob some sand somewhere and bring it back. Like, I think out about here would do it well, because at the moment it looks kind of odd that it's just sand out at the very edge. I think it would look a, a nice little beachfront look, you know? That would be nice. All right, let's take my horse, by which I mean my donkey called horse, and just gaze off into the sunset at 3 p.m. <laughs> But I think we're going to end it there. I hope you enjoyed. I know it was more of a, a laid back episode. Look, there's some floating leaves. That'll make you happy. <laughs> I know people love floating stuff in Minecraft. And continuous laps in my judgment. And look, my farm isn't symmetrical at all. That, that's that got to impress you. But yeah, we got a, a nice bit done. And I found it very relaxing. I enjoyed this a lot. Um, but let me know what you want to see. Because if you don't want to see any more building, that's totally fine as well. I can do this sort of stuff in my downtime. And then we can do the adventures on the videos and uh, I will go on a little adventure next time. I'm debating either going to the end now that I've defeated it and seeing an end city which someone told me about in the comments or else uh, going exploring more of the water because there's a lot of water areas to explore out by my base that I've actually not checked yet or good old-fashioned caves. Uh, we got we got a few options, but let me know about that. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. Appreciate you watching as always and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.